and I told you that for this demonstration I'm going to show you guys how to use the what is it? Green piece rainbow Green cake. Green piece rainbow cake. And you can use it for really any design, including like dragons and skulls. Like it's just a really pretty color combination. It also looks good on people who have um, red and, and orangish hair. So I think that you'll really enjoy it. And it has the golds and metallics in this one as well. So I showed you how to use it with a brush doing a design on her arm. Now I'm going to show you how to use it with your sponge. So basically, one of the easiest ways to load your rainbow cakes is to just mist it with, uh, sorry, no with your water bottle. Um, and because that's, it gets it wet and then you don't have to necessarily worry so much about your sponge being totally wet. So I misted it and I'm just going to rub it across uh, the rainbow cake like this, downward, so that I get all the colors on there. Now for this particular design, I'm going to be doing a design across her forehead and around her eyes. So what I'm going to do <clears throat> is just start with the lightest color on the bottom and make almost like a triangle coming across her forehead. So I'm laying down the colors and you see how beautifully they blend, which is why I really love this, uh, this color combination. So then what I'm going to do as well, close your eyes for one second is I start off diagonal in the corner of her eyes as well and just work my way down right below her eye right there and I'll repeat on this side. The next thing I'm going to do is keeping with that Celtic knot theme I'm going to incorporate that in her design too uh, and make her into kind of like our St. Patrick's princess. So I'm going to start off in the middle of the forehead uh, drawing a heart and this is going to serve as an outline to my heart jewel. And then from there I'm going to build the actual heart jewel right inside of it using a green. Right inside of it make another heart. And then I'm going to give that a full outline in the green. I'm going to outline this white now. The next thing I'm going to do is in the corner of her eyes, I'm going to make some four leaf clovers or three leaf clovers, whatever I have room for. And I'm going to start off by creating them. You can turn a little bit this way. Uh, in white, so I'm going to just draw one heart underneath it, another heart, and on top of it another one, so I can fit three right in here. Made the little swoop underneath it. If you can turn to the other side, so I can do the same. So I start off with one heart, two heart, three hearts. And I make this swoop underneath it, so you can turn this way. And then on the sides, and building off of this design, which is what I'm going to do right now, is I'm going to show you guys how to build some um, some knots and, and build right off of this design. So it's going to end up kind of looking like a pretzel too. So I'm going to make my first kind of candy corn again, and then one on the other side. And you can turn to the camera this way. I know it's a little hard. And then kind of like a triangle-ish underneath it. Okay? So then what I'm going to do is come around, bring that around, connect right there, and then just close it right there. So I'm going to build another one there. And then build off of it. So it's coming down around and build off of it okay so if you guys can see on that side because I'm already on this side I'm just gonna work off of this side and do the same thing I'm gonna build an exterior layer right on top of these right in here I'm gonna move her here just a little bit but she looks so fantastic already 
and I'm making just the little swirls right on top of it, which I'll turn her head and you'll be able to see. Now because I'm working on this side, I'm just going to finish it up on this side before I head over to the other side. So I'm going to start outlining in my green, make some extra layers. So right inside of here, I'm making smaller shamrocks by just filling it in with my brush. In there, but you want to make sure that the tips connect, and then I'm going to outline the entire thing. Just giving it a very slight uh, curve and some teardrops right inside of here, and I'm just going to fill in this area with some of my dots in the dark green right in that side so I can finish the design and I am going to give the top layer a little bit of an outline too before I go ahead and fill in with my green or with my white so I'm just going in giving it this extra layer here giving it so that it all kind of blends together And then I'm going to fill in with my white and give it another outline. And then all we have to do is just repeat this same thing on the other side. So again, I'm just filling it in, filling in my hearts. I'm giving them an outline with the green. So I filled those in, and I'm going to go back in with my green, and I'm just going to give them the knot look and the outline. Just going in, and I am giving it the outline using a dark green, just so that you can see where the actual knots are coming into play. I'm going to fill this in just a little bit more just to brighten it up. And right around here, I'm just going to add a few more of these dots in here too. And I'm going to repeat that same step on the other side. And turn a little bit this way. We're going to repeat the same design on this side. Um, so again, I'm going to start off with my candy corns basically, or these half circles. And then... Um, the bottom piece which is almost kind of like a round diamond and I'll create both of those at the same time so these they look like eyeballs almost when uh, you know like character eyeballs so then I'm just going to come across come around and connect and then do the same thing here I'm going to give this whole thing an outline in a second when we come back in. And I will repeat, if you can turn a little bit this way, on this side by just giving it another exterior layer. And some just little sprinkle of dots in here in between as necessary. I'm going to fill in an outline with some of this uh, dark green in a second. Painting right on top of it to fill in my hearts. 